Hello, I am Mac, at least for a day. This is a Center of Excellence base showcase. Another awesome farm base that players of No Man's Sky on PlayStation 4 Euclid Galaxy uh, can visit to get resources and make money. The creator of this Center of Excellence is a Spacing Guild member named TNT Musician. Are you there? Yes. Great. Hello. So I'm going to go through the portal. As usual, the a link to the Spacing Guild website will be on this video. So you can look, go to our website, go to Centers of Excellence, and find TNT Musicians um, article, which I'll be putting up soon, and um, get the portal address from there. Cool thing about your location is that you're close to the Galactic Center, right? Yes. I am like right there, very close. Neat. Okay. And, oh, there you are. Yep. Hello. And I see where your base is. Um, you can see the beacon? Okay. Oops. Almost built the wrong vehicle. There we go. Okay. So you want to race there? Sure. Okay. I'll let you say when to go. Okay, go. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Is this a moon? Nope. Oh. But it, it is, it's a very fun planet for an exocraft. Yeah, it must be elevation that's making your base look so um, far below the ground. Like we're on a hill and it's lower or something. Like on a moon, you know, since moons are a lot smaller, um, if something is a little ways away from you, it'll be below you because it's around the curvature of the moon. But, yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to distract you oh. so I can beat you. <laughs> You're winning. <laughs> yeah. You, you, you must have hit a really good jump there. Yeah, I I've, haven't got it quite. I've, I've um, live streamed for hours, you know, running around on my Nomad, so I'm used to jumping off ramps constantly. Yeah, there's one really high jump close to there. I haven't memorized exactly where it's at, but it's really cool. Yep, I, I really like these planets with the snaky rock formations, because you can drive around on them like they're highways or something. Yep. This is a really pretty planet. Yeah, it, it's different. I, I haven't seen a whole lot of the, the rock formations like this uh, before the update I did. Um, but it was the orange grass. Yeah. Because so, I've seen a lot of green ones. I've come across quite a few purple ones and blue ones. But not a whole lot of orange grass. So. Yep. They, Hello Games said that they're going to do an improvement to trees on lush planets like either make them bigger or more numerous or both or something like that um, but they've they've been quiet as far as updates go for like over 20 days so I'm guessing that that fix will probably come in the 1.4 update whenever that happens I just found the jump <laughs> oh yeah yeah did you come across a big jump um, I don't know which one. Okay. It's really big. I wish I could build a racetrack along with the base on this one. Yeah. I, I don't have enough um, room to do that. Probably creative mode would be better for that since, um, you know, farm bases aren't useful. In creative mode. Yeah. OK. 
Okay, I made it. You are two minutes away. <laughs> I'll wait wow, for you to you get really, here. <laughs> that was really fast. Wow, your your base is really cool. I like how it's all floating in the air with just a ladder. Yeah, it's got a lot of um, beams, but I still find ways to fall off of it. <laughs> Reminds me of the Jetsons, if anyone remembers that show. They had houses that were like these dome things way up in the air with just like a tiny little metal pole holding them up. Mm -hmm. I don't think they ever explained why their houses were like that. I always guessed maybe it was because the ground was so polluted they had to live up there. <laughs> Do you want to make a monument? Uh, you might want to, because it's laggy, uh, either at the portal or like a little bit far from the base, because I've sure. heard sometimes when they are when they get close to limit, it makes them really laggy. Sure, so, wherever you want to do it. Um, right here would be good. Okay. And there you go. Cool. Okay, I'll let you give me the tour of the base. Wow, this, okay, this uh, grass is so beautiful. Sorry. <laughs> um, it, this base, the way I set it up is, especially for like missions, if anybody does missions, you can make everything at this base. Uh, so you can make the circuit boards, the little grenades, and everything, living, uh, the, the glass, everything. Nice. So, um, I, I think I did enough for four, yeah, four circuit boards. Let me look at the menu. It's uh, four circuit boards. Um, you can make the heat capacitors. It's two liquid explosives, um, two uh, living glass. And I did uh, 10 of the Gravitino balls because if you like to build your ship like I do, it takes 20 of them. And you only get half of them back. So it's, instead of somebody trying to find them, they can come here and there's 10 of them here. Great. So, it's got everything. Um, there's 34 star bulb, star bulb around here. So. Okay. Alright, here's the uh, crossword. Great. There's three more up top uh, and with the uh, Gravitinos. I like the ramps. Yeah. Uh, this is miscellaneous, but the, the Gamma Weed, I had to put three of them here to, to add to the, uh, to make sure I had enough. And here's more of them over here. Great. And this isn't just a good farm, this is a fun place to visit, the way it's constructed. Yep. Mm -hmm. And here's the solar vine, I have another dome of these all the way at top too. They're at the very top. And that's the first level, that's four domes. Second level has four domes too. Whoa, I fell okay. off. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta get back up there real quick. Gotta be careful on those ramps. Yeah, I tried to make it to where you couldn't fall off easily, but like I said, I still find ways to fall off. Okay, I made it up. I think. There you are. Okay. Okay, and here's the yeah, fungal cluster, and you only, and for acid, one yep. more dike. Yeah, and here's another one over here. Because you can combine that with the, um, what is it, the, uh, what is it called, the unstable gel to make the um, it, uh, liquid, liquid explosive. explosive. And that's worth, yeah, and, it make, and it's worth more. And over here is the uh, K-1 
cactus splash. Wow, and you had to anybody... get you had to get the rest. Um, did you build this after the update? Yes. So you had I to memorized... get you had to get the recipe for um, organic compound to make these mm -hmm. doors. Wow. Yes. And here's um, the Gecknip and you know just miscellaneous stuff like if somebody wants to do a pearl farm it takes three pearls so yep. here's six it's enough to give you know give them two to start with on their on their planet if they want to yeah are you above me nope not yet I lost now where I'm you up are. here okay you're on the opposite side yeah <laughs> I'll come over there Yep. Oh, okay okay here's more of the uh the solar vine for making the circuit boards and over here I had to have three more of the uh, frost work. so there's three here and then there's ten gravitinos nice. for you know for building stuff for your ship yeah because you need and, ten for yeah some upgrades yeah and the way I do mine I have to have 20 and when you break it down it usually gives you half back so um, one thing I forgot to show you, it's on the first level, okay. is, so, um, everybody wouldn't have to keep going down to the, all the way down there where the star bulbs are, to, to, to the trade terminal. I put it up here to make it, oh. you know, a little bit easier. Whoa, what? Oh, I fell off. <laughs> I was about to remark how cool looking that is. Oh, wow, that is neat that you... You made this little bitty cube underneath a um, underneath a dome. That's really creative. Yeah. Yeah. The trade so terminals that way here. Have, yeah, that way we wouldn't have to keep going down and up, you know, to sell stuff. They could, you know, just come to the first level and. That's there great. It is. Yeah. As long as they don't fall off trying to get to it. <laughs> yeah, I tried. I can't close it anymore. I haven't yep. figured out a way to close it anymore where the ramps are so it, it's worth it for how cool looking it is yeah so, and that's basically it i mean it, yeah. it's, it's you know it's got everything here so if if you're doing a mission some things they ask you for that i don't want to spoil anything for anybody who hasn't done them yet but you can this base you can make that stuff here yep so okay i'm going to go down and put my seal of approval Calm station here. Great. So, thanks a lot for giving me the tour, uh, TNT Musician. Yep. Thanks this for stopping by and visiting. <laughs> yep. This has been her Center of Excellence, which, again, you can get the address for it in at the Spacing Guild website, which will be in a um, pinned comment on this video. Uh, you just need... you got to... You got to be on PlayStation 4, the Euclid Galaxy, and it's normal mode. So, thank you all for watching, and we'll catch you in the future.